Speaking of virtual spud, I was one. Um, I think it'd be interesting if you could explain kind of your virtual how you how you set this whole thing up here because I really haven't seen something like this on Facebook Live and it's uh, pretty innovative and I'm kind of interested about it. Oh man, definitely, man. Well, it's my uh, personal uh, studio configuration VSC. It's something I've created. Um, I've been rocking with this for the past seven years now. Um, I don't know if you remember, but when I first interviewed you. That's how I was able to capture our audio directly from your phones and um, the Skype call-ins. And I have everything's mm -hmm. routed to my studio. Um, this goes for analog and digital setup. I have the configuration for analog users and digital users to transfer their audio directly over the net in stereo. And mm -hmm. a lot of times the way guys wire their studio, you know, if you're just plugging your output to your microphone input, that creates an audio loop. That creates a problem when someone else mm -hmm. has the same type of setup that you have. My configuration is totally independent where my audio goes to you. I don't have to worry about your studio audio coming from me. It's totally independent. It has its own channel, keeping everything mm -hmm. on its own channel. That's where it's at. And having that independent control of your internet audio and your studio audio. Mm -hmm. You know, so what the configuration does is my DAW audio my analog instruments needs to go to you right mm -hmm. I need to find some way to get your audio back to me without bleeding through my studio and sending that back to you again so we create that audio loop that we hear mm -hmm. time and time again and in addition to that incoming calls from cell phones and landlines that's going to be triggered through my studio as well so the incoming coin that you receive from the guest that was watching she's hearing this on Facebook live right now so mm -hmm. she's able to talk to you with her audio, you can hear it back in real time. Yeah. Send your audio from your microphone back to her in her cell phone or her telephone on her landline, and mm -hmm. including my audio. And there's no loop feedbacks. Everybody heard Dang. each other. Everything was stable. And to me, because of social media, this is the way that we need to re rethink the way we rewire our studio. We want to be totally in synchronized and in conjunction with Skype. Uvu, whatever web chat service that you're using, we want to be able to channel that audio directly to and from each other without playing it through our speakers and pushing it to the microphones, you know, because that creates mm -hmm. room noise and distortion and you really can't crank it up and people on the other end can't really hear you, you know. Yeah. So by going in headphones, using a good mic like we're using and mm -hmm. wired the studio with VSC, this allows us to collaborate online. Um, so if you and I are working on a track and you, you want a specific EQ, you'll be able to hear the bass, you'll be able to hear the treble. We could do a full mix online in stereo mm -hmm. and work together on a song in collaboration.